Hey there, fellow adventurers. Welcome back to AI Tutorials, the channel that's always on the lookout for the best tools to supercharge your journey. I'm your host, and today, get ready for an epic quest as we unveil the top 7 free mid-journey alternatives. These alternatives are most powerful than mid-journey. That's right, we've scoured the digital realm to bring you the most powerful, jaw-dropping alternatives that won't cost you a single gold coin and transform text to unlimited images using eye. From mind-bending features to user-friendly interface, we've got it all covered. But hey, there's a twist. Stay till the end for an exclusive bonus tip that will blow your mind. Trust me, you won't want to miss it. There are numerous AI art generators out there, but very few come close to Midjourney's capabilities. So in this video, we bring you the seven best mid-journey alternatives that are mostly free and have a powerful texture image model. So, let's jump to the video. On number seven we have, Blue Willow is an interesting alternative to mid-journey that has amassed more than 300 million users on its Discord server. It's completely free to use and runs on user donation. You can join the Blue Willow Discord server and enter your prompt to generate images then and there. People are using Blue Willow to create logos, characters from comics, landscapes, graphic concepts, digital artworks, and more. I tried some prompts, and it generated some decent images. However, when it comes to realistic settings, Blue Willow falls short of mid-journey. Nevertheless, Blue Willow does a fantastic job with any type of digital art or graphics. The fact that this program generates photos in under a minute while having a vast user base is what I enjoyed about it the most. In conclusion, Blue Willow is a promising free mid-journey substitute that you should unquestionably testament. Go ahead and use Blue Willow to convert text to images for free without paying anything. But if you don't like this, you might love number one alternative. On number 6 we have Playground AI. Playground AI is another fantastic AI image creator website that hosts Stable Diffusion and Dale. The best part about Playground AI is that it lets you create 1000 images per day for free, which is just bonkers. However, you can't use the Dale model under the free version, and there might be some limits on quality and details after 50 images. To sum up, Playground Eye is a promising free alternative to mid-journey and you should definitely give it a try. Retool number 5 is Instantshot. Instantshot is not a texture image model per se, but it hosts more than 25 such models, which you can use to instantly create a generated images. It includes powerful AI models like Stable Diffusion, Midjourney V4, Anything V3, Waifu, Synth or Vepunk, icons me, and a lot more. The website is easy to navigate. You enter your prompt in natural language, add some negative prompts you want, choose the model and you are good to go. You make the decision. The website does not choose the model for you automatically. I would think that Instantshot is the greatest option if you want to experiment with various texture image models and contrast mid-journey with other similar goods. Additionally, you have the opportunity to select the image size, with a maximum size of 768 by 512. Finally, because Instantshot also allows you to utilize Midjourney V4 for free, I truly appreciate it. Let's jump to number 4 alternative of Midjourney to convert text to image. This one is Adobe Firefly. Adobe Firefly has a number of tools for text to image generation, image expansion, vectory coloring, text effects, in painting, sketch to image, and more. However, most of the tools are still in development, but Adobe has already released the text to image tool, and currently, it's free to all users. Best on number three is Leonardo.we. Leonardo I is a hot new text to image generation model that is being compared to mid journey right now. It's not open to all and the early bird access is only available to a select few users. However, you can choose to join its Discord server to check out its amazing capabilities in generating highly detailed images. Even better, you can build images for your customized surroundings using an AI model you trained yourself. That Leonardo is what caught my attention the most. AI is also adept at generating human looks with flawless eyes. Therefore, 
Leonardo is a good option if you are looking for a strong texture image model like Midjourney. The pros of this ARI tool is that it is free for early access. This IE is a fantastic alternative. Oh, now we're going to the best of the time tools in image generation. This is bonus to you watching this video. Let's jump to the alternative number two, called Dale2. Dale2 is arguably the best mid-journey alternative that you can use to generate images right now. It has been developed by OpenEye, the company behind chat. You can use it to create photorealistic images from descriptions in natural language. The best part about DALE 2 is its ability to comprehend your prompt and combine diverse ideas, aesthetics, and characteristics to produce an original, unexpected image. In addition, it may enlarge photographs to make a new canvas. Use the in-painting tool to eliminate objects, add shadows, textures, and reflections, and do much more. Overall, I believe DALE 2 to be a strong texture image model that you should use instead of Midjourney. If you want to use this look in description to get the direct link, you can test it by its free 15 credits and buy more if it satisfy your wishes. This is best alternative of Midjourney after this first one called Stable Diffusion. But before we go, Remember to subscribe to this channel and open notification for more videos about artificial intelligence. Let's continue to the first websites to generate images from text. If there is a text or image model that can come very close to Midjourney, then it's Stable Diffusion. Unlike Midjourney, which is a paid and proprietary model, Stable Diffusion is a free and open source model, and it can be installed even on a local PC having at least 8 GB of RAM. Stable Diffusion is already used by many websites and apps to quickly generate images from text input. Stable Diffusion has produced photographs quickly when I've used it in the past, which is a lot. The most recent SD Excel beta is working to improve the generated image quality, which is still inferior than Midjourney's. The inability of stable diffusion to accurately represent hands, fingers, and eyes causes them to appear out of place in pictures of people, which is one of its major flaws. Aside from that, though, it's a strong texture image paradigm that you should consider using. And that wraps up today's video. Thank you so much for watching. If you enjoyed this content, don't forget to hit that subscribe button and give it a thumbs up. Remember, new videos are posted every week. So stay tuned. Until next time, take care and stay awesome.